welcome back to Neverwinter. Uh, today's video is for the beginners uh, who just started uh, playing Neverwinter or for the people who's been, you know, like gone for a while, took a break uh, and came back uh, because I been, you know, like requested or asked you know like um, this one question which is how to level up your character uh, I'll try my best to explain um, I will try to make it clear for you guys I will try to make it like step by step it's gonna be a little bit long but you know I'll do my best okay so my character is level 60 it's not you know I'm not the strongest here <laughs> just to be clear but I manage and I take you know a lot of time to die so uh, that's a you know like what do you need uh, you can you know like if you know what are you doing you can be higher level but for me, you know, like I take a break from Neverwinter and then I come back. So I don't usually level up um, uh, like fully for uh, my enchantments or, you know, like my gear. But I will show you what to do. And hopefully you guys will be even a higher level than me. <laughs> so, um let's see first your gear let's just start with the easiest one uh your gear it depends on your uh character like if you are a uh, dps healer tank uh you like pick the right equipment uh for your character just make sure you know uh, it has what you need and it's a higher uh, level uh, these days I've noticed that there is a lot of um, in the uh, what do you call it the campaigns uh, like you receive a high level items as you can see in here by the way the mount will help you a lot so don't be like yeah i don't need that yes you do need that um insignia uh you know like back in the days when i used to play it we didn't have these kind of rewards we you know like play and you know do our best to unlock these stuff or buy them or use a key and just hope for the best uh, but I'm just saying like these items if you are new it will help you and this campaign is not gonna end until August 31st uh, so you still have time uh, to unlock these I'm sure there's more stuff that you unlock uh, like this new uh, dragon slayer because it has these new very powerful equipment uh, just do some uh, hunting with your friends and try to reach level 100 because it requires uh, rank 100 uh, to rank 100 not the level that you know with your character no just the hunting level so don't worry about it <laughs> uh, and you should be able to unlock all these stuff which is gonna help you a lot uh, my level uh, for the dragon hunt is 62 as you can see so I need to do more but anyways this is like I said for the gear you pick 
the uh, you know like strong level for the gear or the highest item level for the gear and um, that will help you level up uh, you equip the uh, reinforcement will help as well like in here I'm equipping uh, power for it so my power states will be higher and uh, you can you know, like go for anything you like in here uh, mine is not the best there's way best characters but for me DPS you know power and for I'm sorry for my healer I'll try to um, outgoing healing as you can see so I'm focusing on this stuff uh, and you know uh, it depends on your character or what you want to level up um, make sure you pick the uh, uh, like I said, the ride reinforcement that you want. And here I added stamina. Uh, rings will help you a lot to level up, you know, the good quality for the rings. Um, and just make sure your whole gear is like high level. Uh, okay, for the artifacts. Uh, make sure it's like fully upgraded reach maximum uh, because you want the best uh, um, like you want the best item but you want it to be the highest level and um, this one, as you can see, damaging, if I did upgrade it, will be uh, 83,000. If I did upgrade it. If I didn't, it will be 55,000. So the max level is the best make sure you max the artifacts that you want and make sure they are fully uh, uh, upgraded these things I'm not talking about them much because after all it's your choice you pick wherever you know artifact you want because it's up to your um, up to your uh, character or the class that you choose but I'm just saying like make sure they are fully upgrade wherever it is wherever artifact you're using make sure it's fully upgrade and make sure your gear is high level uh, like in here item level 1850 1800 uh, 1250 these will help you a lot and if you equip a reinforcement or you added a reinforcement that will help you to level up as well so um, uh, yeah I think we're done for gear okay for the enchantments I'm not the best as you can see I have random things but if you have a higher uh, level for your enchantments that will be perfect uh, like I said these in here are random because it depends on your character uh, your character I'm sure it's different than mine and like I said I'm random 
<laughs> but I do great and um, you know like I manage I don't die a lot and I kill enemies fast so uh, I'm good with that but you know in the future I will do some changes of course but um yeah uh, the problem with the enchantment is that they a little bit expensive uh, but I don't think yeah even the upgrade will be you know like a lot of a problem but you know if you're farming uh you know the um doing your daily quests and stuff it shouldn't be a problem for you to uh, level up your enchantments uh, you can uh, get, you know, even I don't have a lot of gold, so like I said, I take a break from Neverwinter, I get back, so I don't have uh, a lot of stuff in here, as you can see. Uh, okay, power, even that, that's up to you. It depends on your character. I'm not you know like i'm telling you like do the same build that i did because mine is different than yours you may not like it so besides that's not gonna do much you know like for the leveling up uh but you know if you did it right for your class or character that will do you good okay uh you need boons for leveling up that's and absolutely uh, you have to get as much as booze as you can see in here I have 89 uh, and um, you know just pick wherever you like in these tiers in here again it depends on your character <laughs> um, and how to get boons from campaigns as you can see in here so when you go to campaigns uh, you have um, campaigns that you finish and here for the path of the fallen it will give you four boons which is excellent Sharender uh, this one doesn't have uh, I'm sorry uh, they said but they changed the picture <laughs> my bad uh, Sharander if you did the weekly thing for the campaign you'll get two boons in here and two in here and two in here so total six boons for Sharander uh, Dragon Bone Veil, same as uh, Sharander. Uh, the old ones, the old ones are the best because you get a lot of boons. Uh, here you get boons when you're done from Dread Ring. Uh, Storm King's Hunter has a lot of boon. Uh, one, two, three, four, five six and seven that I didn't finish yet because I'm missing requirements uh, you get a lot of boons in here as you can see all the uh, all the campaigns has boons that you can uh, achieve and then go to character boons and again it depends on your character pick anything that you like you're comfortable with that will make your character strong uh, if you're like fully uh, up a grade in here like five out of five that will help you level up your character so yeah what you need is uh, boons to level up your character 
and um, enchantments try to equip a high level enchantments even the blue ones they are pretty good so don't be like yeah I'm low level I can't do uh, queues or missions don't worry you're gonna be fine uh, the blue ones are not really that bad they do the job so um, next companions companions maybe some people they don't realize but uh, as you can see in here this one gives life meaning. is fully upgrade this one and a few others that I upgraded uh, I have a lot that I did fully upgrade. Even the ones that I'm not using, I did upgrade them. Why? Because that will make my level higher as long as I have them. Even if I don't use them at all, but as as long as you have them with you, that you own them and you did level them up, that will help you level up your character um, okay for your companion you need a good high level uh, equipment and like I said earlier uh, you can get from I think it's here I'm not sure uh, you can get like uh, uh, companion equipment I think here yeah there you go and you can choose you know like wherever you want uh, for your companion these are really high level uh, equipment and um, just do the daily uh, campaigns for sorry for the uh, dragon uh, raid campaign and you should be able to unlock it and after that uh, pick the nice ones that you like and you know they should be you know helpful really helpful and will do the job for you and uh, level up your character and you can go to Sharender I think and there is like a, a daily missions that you do uh, I don't remember the name of it I hasn't been there for a while um, hold on. Uh, let me show it to you guys because if you repeated that quest, you can get uh, equipment for your for your companion, and they really have a nice equipment. Most of them are high level. I just want to show you the place and then I'll get back because uh, it should be right here right here ah bounty okay I'm sorry I forgot the name of it <laughs> but yeah these are three bounties that you finish and then when you're done it will reward you these are the rewards as you can see for uh, the last one in purple a piece of uh, 1300 item level companion gear uh, which is not bad that will help you um, uh, level up real fast so um, 
Okay, now the companion. We talked about that, you know, you have to level up your companion. Uh, even the ones that you don't use. I know there are a lot, but, you know, just do the best for the companions that you think that they are strong and they're gonna do you best. Um, so... Mm, what else? Okay. Companion bonuses. Try for my DPS. I don't know about your character. For my DPS, I tried, as you can see in here, to get power. So this guy in here, as you can see on the top, it gave me a 7.5 point, 7 plus power and this guy in here gave me 3.8 plus power <clears throat> and this in here uh, gave me deflect chance with 1.5 plus power. Uh, the uh, ghost's wisdom 3.8 plus uh, power and you can see I'm focusing on powers so if you got like this one in here on the top then uh, baby deep crows if you got it like level um, I don't know, like, uh, not a high level, like, uh, let's just say blue or purple. The power will be less. It's going to be like maybe five, five or plus something. But because I have it maxed in here, um, let me show you, as you can see in here, it's fully upgraded. So when I equip it, the... Uh, you know like the power will be um fully maxed so the item level will be fully maxed and you know that will help me a lot which is item level 750 uh oops i'm sorry <laughs> um but yeah uh like i said upgrade your uh, companions as much as you can even the ones that you don't use because they will help you a lot level up your character and when you go to companion bonuses uh, make sure you pick uh, the ones that you you know like you need and will help you in your defense or uh, universal or the uh, offense power wherever slots uh, that you pick pick the right companion uh, and you know uh, uh, to boost your level I want to show you uh, my healer just to give you an example in here uh, I have power because of course I need it but in here I have the outgoing heals and um, in here same uh, I get heals and here heals nearby friends for 75% and this one for maximum hit points so as you can see, uh, it depends on your character, I'm choosing the thing that will help me uh, for, you know, like boosting my stats plus my level. And um, it did help a lot. Uh, as you can see in here, my outgoing is pretty well, it's not really that bad. Uh, but yeah, um, let me get back to my DPS.
and I equip the other ones and focus just on power and my stats, you know, like power is max. So, uh, we talked about companions, I, again, uh, level up, try to max level, and pick the right equipments and the enchantments. Mine is not really high level, it's 300, but, you know, like I said, it does the job. And um, the companion bonuses will help. And you pick the one that you know you see will help you a lot. Even you know like you don't use that companion. Like for example, I don't use this uh, mighty insight, but I did fully upgrade it and I have equipped because you know it, it helps me a little bit with my power boost. So for the mounts. Um, you get a lot of mounts from the campaign i think this one as well uh do you get it no not here this one this one you get legendary mounts and in here you get legendary mounts as well uh that will help you get you know like strong mounts and um you know you can equip it it has each one has a combat power mm, i like the swarm and i like the t-rex these are really powerful ones so um they will help you a lot uh because as you can see in here increases damage and slows the target and increases incoming damage to target by 15 percent and uh, you know like it does a really really good job even the one in here helps so pick the good compact combat sorry <laughs> power and um uh that will help you uh kill the enemies faster for me in here i just like uh this one uh the dominant force i don't know i have a lot but mm, i don't use them I mean, if you like other things, yes, of course, you can equip it, but for me, I like the dominant force because it gives me 4,500 plus power. So, yeah, that will help me a lot. And for the stable, as you can see, I have my... Uh, my um my mounts fully upgraded they are maxed but my uh color uh and my uh what's it called uh insignia they are not high level but still they do help me uh you know level up my uh character so if you can max out all these three, your color, mount, and your insignia, you should be golden. So, And you can pick uh, the uh, power from the insignia, depends on uh, your character. Like for example here, the gold dragon wings, you can pick anything from these anything depends or the uh, depends on the uh, insignia they use so um, just pick wherever you like and uh, choose the right insignia for it and that will boost you as well uh, 
uh, mostly I picked for you know like uh, companion uh, I picked the uh, your summoned companion does more damage I think it damage yeah as you can see here a damage for 20 more 20% uh, more damage so that you know helps a lot and this one you know uh, for um, power um, but yeah I picked these stuff you know for my DPS and um, this should help uh level up your character so um upgrade your collar mount insignia upgrade your uh companions uh upgrade your equipment enchantments and choose the right companion bonuses that will give you either strength, outgoing heal, wherever, you know, if you're a tank, I don't know what do you pick for it, because I'm sorry, never been a tank, and I suck at it, <laughs> and uh, collect as much as, you know, boons that you need, and pick whatever tier that you like, any, any boon that you like in here. Uh, for each tier and um, that will help you level up as well and um, pick the highest gear level they can find uh, make sure you upgrade your artifacts so yeah I think that's that's how you level up uh, I don't know if I'm missing something, but I hope I'm not. Uh, so yeah, that's how you level up. Uh, try to do my best to explain. I'm sorry if I did that. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, if you have any question feel free to ask and I'll do my best to help um, I hope this video helped you guys uh, this was pretty as hell and thanks for watching